Amy, darling, not now. Come on. Nobody has any time for me. Daddy's tired, okay? I've had a long day. Go play with Kyle. Kyle never wants to play with me. Kyle, get off that stupid DS and play with your sis. Mommy plays baby card games, Dad. Mommy's always busy, too. Yeah? With what? With what? You try cooking and cleaning. And doing groceries. And taking a six-year-old to school. And doing volunteer work. Hannah, not the dramatics, please. Can I get a cup of tea? Or is that too much to ask a wife these days? With all this political correctness and women's lib and all that crap. Oh, yes, your majesty. What else would you like? A gourmet six-course meal? Well, I'll, I'll give you a discount on that one. How about a four-course meal? <laughs> Why don't you make me dinner for once, huh? For once? Haven't I made you dinner tons of times? Yeah, but when? And those frozen enchiladas that still had icicles in it don't count. What about that lovely omelet I made you last week? <laughs> An omelet? Really? That does not even count as cooking. And certainly not when it's burnt almost to a crisp. Well, I do like my eggs a bit well made, so, you know. Yeah, so it's always about you. What about what I like for once? There. I made my own tea. Happy? No, I am not happy. You left the sugar can open, as always. <sighs> Don't blame me if you find big lumps. You can use them as golf balls for your next game. Oh, sorry. It's just that I have a lot on my mind, Hannah. You know the release is coming up and the boss is after me and... Uh, why can't men do anything right? Hey, why don't you women try doing the taxes, huh? And deal with the stock market, which is about as moody as you are these days. Yeah, and why don't you try doing the laundry? Remember when he mixed the colors with the whites? <laughs> oh, my white underwear turned pink. Blech. I like pink underwear, by the way. You do? I didn't know that. Colors with whites. When was that a big deal? It's not the end of the world. Do you even know what the schedule E is? Have you ever done the 1040? I slog my butt filling it out and you just sign it. Colors bleed, Mike. God, you men are such duffers. Look, men and women have their niches. Women clean the kitchen. Men mow the lawn. That's how it's been for ages. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Women are good only for the maid work, right? I didn't say that. I, what I meant was that men have for thousands of years done outside work. Hunting, working in the fields. They have better things to think about than closing a container. Our brains are... Tiny. Your brains are so tiny, you can't do such a simple thing. What do you think, Amy? Are men really stupid? Uh, oh, you did forget to put the car in park once, Dad. And it ended up in the pool. Oh, that. I had a long day. I was dead tired. And excuses, excuses. And remember when you parked in front of the neighbor's driveway and the cops impounded it. And we ended up paying $500. It was dark and rainy. The fall leaves made it impossible to see the curve. A anyway, my point is, men have their areas. And you imposed all the crap areas on us. Like what? Like cleaning the toilets after the awful mess you men make. You women are nasty as hell, too. You ever been in a woman's restroom? You were in a girl's restroom? Daddy's been in the girl's toilet. Daddy's the nigger's toilet. <laughs> the girl's toilet? Ew. Well, um, it was kind of an emergency. The men's side was closed for cleaning. That's gross. Anyway, show me proof we men put a gun to your head and force you to stay home and clean the toilets. Yes, you did. 
For centuries, we were locked up and forced to do your shit because you wanted us to be your slaves and subjugate us. Maybe you just took the easy route. Rather than work in the fields all day in the sweltering heat. Yeah, right. You made it look like you got the worst deal. Yeah, we're all such manipulators, right? Mm -hmm. Don't forget, you have a daughter. Is that what you're teaching her? Ah! Oh. We, we paid the bill, right? Yes, 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 yes. Don't worry about it. Don't touch anything. I'll find it. Okay. It was on the news. They're shutting down the power due to the wildfires. Can you believe it? Candles in the 21st century. It's not the end of the world. It's just for an hour. Yeah, you're right. It's not the end of the world, and to hell with this software release crap. So, Kyle, have you decided what you want to be when you grow up? A scientist, maybe? Oh, I want to be a scientist, Daddy. I don't want to do stupid algebra all day. Stupid algebra. Algebra is the cornerstone of everything, Kyle. I don't see how stalling for X and Y is in the world any good. How about a doctor? Mm -hmm. A lawyer? I want to be a chef, Dad. What? A chef? Really? That's great, Kyle. I know you got your cooking side for me. You'll make an excellent chef. You want to be in the kitchen and cook all your life. I want to be the world's best chef. I want to be an iron chef one day. That's all he watches on TV all day. Iron chef. You're encouraging this. I thought you said men are just bad in the kitchen. You are bad in the kitchen. Not all men. <laughs> and I want to be a stay-at-home parent and do the chores like mom does. You want to cook? Clean and do the laundry. Yep, yep, and yep. And sit at home while your future wife earns the bread. I just hate a nine-to-five job. It's so boring. Well, sitting at home can be boring, too. I'm going to be in NASA. In NASA? Go on. Tell her that girls clean the kitchen and boys do the lawn. That women are only good for the inside work. That it's in our DNA. And for millions of years, men did the outside work and the women did the housework. Well, I mean... She's great at math and she got an A on her science project. Wow, Amy. Good job. I had no idea you were good at STEM. Huh? What do you want to be at NASA? An astronaut. And go to space. And then the moon. You think you cut out for it? You don't think it's a bit uh, dangerous? Dangerous for women? Go on, say it. I didn't say that. You did. Anything a man can do, I can. Yes, you can, sweetie. I'm proud of you. You, you think I can be an astronaut someday, Daddy? <laughs> of course, dear. You can be anything you put your heart to. I'm sorry if I've been a bit judgmental. I'm a bit stressed, especially with this release coming up. There's a new girl at work. She's a programming whiz. She's not half as good as you, I bet. No, definitely not. Oh, what was I thinking even asking that? Of course she's not as good as you. She's a woman after all. Fine. I'll admit it. She's good. And they're thinking of promoting her. So you're going to work under a woman. How awful. Is that what's been bugging you, Mike? It's okay, Daddy. It's just a job. Do a bit nine to five job. <clears throat> Don't you wish we didn't have all these? buckets about what a girl and a boy can do the world would just be a better place yeah you're right there shouldn't be any buckets
then you're okay with me being a chef? Yes, Kyle. Be the best at what you want to be. That's more important. And I'm going to be the first girl to land on the moon. The first girl on the moon and the Iron Chef. Let's toast to that. Tell me.